What's going on everybody? It's Aster here and welcome back to another Call of Duty Black Ops 3 video and in today's video you guys are going to be watching another nuclear gameplay that I got for you guys today. Now in this gameplay I was using the Mana War with Fast Mags, Extended Mags, Rapid Fire, and Quick Draw. Um, I'm not using stock on this class just because I pretty much use this class mostly on Nuketown and I really don't see a use for the stock on it in my opinion because I do jump around a whole bunch on that map and I really do not stray for pretty much be on the ground in general. So it is kind of annoying not having Tack Mask on that class. So you can take off one of the attachments and put on a tactic mask or a C4 with a pistol or something like that. It just kind of depends on whatever floats your boat. But yeah, uh, sadly enough, they did take out the Nuketown 24-7 playlist today and replaced it with the uh, Snowy Redwood or whatever it's called. Um, I am kind of disappointed by that, but I can't really say I'm surprised that they took Nuketown out already. And it, today is Tuesday, I believe. So... It, the playlist only lasted about four days while it should have lasted until Friday, so it should have had another at least three days of life cycle. Not really surprised it got taken out because Chaos Mosh Pit got removed from the game, as you guys do know and probably don't like, because I guess it has something to do with trapping, and I feel like people at Treyarch are trying to discourage people from being able to manipulate the score so much for them to increase their leaderboard spots or something like that. That's just my guess. I really think it's really stupid. But I'm not a game developer, so I can't really do anything with that. Now, however, we did get an update yesterday. It did add a couple new bodies to the game, um, as well as a new head for the specialist. It's a cool blue one. I actually do kind of like it, and I hope I do get it. Um, now, people are probably going to be saying, well, we're probably going to get new weapons today. At the time I am recording this, there is no been no update for new weapons yet. But I'm saying it probably doesn't look very probable. Now, if it does happen, it's cool, but I'm not getting my hopes up because that's what a lot of people like to do. And I just really don't want to get myself disappointed if it doesn't happen. But yeah, um, <clears throat> excuse me. Thank you guys for all the support and everything on yesterday's top five video. I was really impressed with everybody who said in their clips and everything like that. I know I really don't get to talk a whole bunch on those videos because they are so short and there's really no time for much explanation besides just me commentating over the clips. But I do appreciate all the support and everything like that on those videos for you guys. Now in this gameplay, going back to it, it was a double nuclear fail. Um, I did show the first half of the nuclear that I did get and then um, I did cut out the parts where I died in between that and I jumped into the second streak part where I believe I died on a 26 gun streak. I don't know, but... Um, yeah, I, I can't believe watching this footage over again how I didn't see the guy who killed me. I must be blind or something like that. Because, I mean, literally, you can see him on the hater clear as day. You can see him clear as day in front of me. I, I, I guess I was just tripping or something like that. But, you know, whatever. It wasn't meant to be. Technically, it was a combined double nuclear. So, I can still say it was a double nuke because I did get six unstoppables from the first one. Even though I did die on the 26 on the second one. But, you know, it is what it is. I'll keep grinding. Hopefully, I can get it. Hopefully I can get a double nuke gameplay for you guys soon. Um, I have a feeling it'll be coming because, I mean, I'm getting a lot better at this game and everything like that. So, yeah. Um, thank you guys for all the support and everything like that. And I'm going to clip Labyrinth for now. And if you guys have any questions or anything like that, just leave them down in the comment section below. And if there's any new guns or anything like that that comes to the game, you guys will be sure that I'll be getting some gameplays with them and showcasing them for you guys. So, yeah. Thank you guys for all the support. And I'll see you guys in the next video. This is Acer and I'm out. Peace.